For the second time this week, a moose has been spotted in a densely populated southern Maine neighborhood. While this sighting may seem unusual, biologists say it's not, and authorities are cautioning people to give the moose some space. Oh my gosh. It comes with the territory of living in Maine. Hey, bud. But when you see a moose, you don't expect it to happen here. Yeah, there's definitely a moose on Willard Beach. Or right here. Hey, Mr. Moose. It started earlier this week in Scarborough, a young bull moose roaming through town. I saw some legs. Then Tuesday night. I thought it was a horse. Jewel Church spotted a moose outside her South Portland home. I was just in awe the first time he went down. I just kind of sat and watched because... It, what an amazing animal. It really is. By Wednesday morning, a moose had also been spotted at several more locations, including the Southern Maine Community College campus. In comparing photos, biologists believe it's likely the same moose. Brad Zitsky tells New Center Maine it's common to see moose on the move this time of year. The males are full of hormones, looking for mating prospects. So he showed up in my it. house. <laughs> New Center Maine's Peggy Kaiser. Well was the one who captured video of the moose right in her dooryard. It's right outside my window, you know, five feet away. Police and game wardens cautioned people and their pets to keep a distance and give him some space. This all unfolding as the moose hunt begins hundreds of miles north. Albro Copperthwaite, the director of North Main Woods, says the moose have changed their behavior in the 40 years since the moose hunt began. They've learned to to, to get out of sight. For those who were paid an up close and personal visit, it's certainly a story you can file under only in Maine. It really was an amazing sight because I was just, wow, we have a moose in our neighborhood. <laughs> so the warden service is keeping tabs on the movement of the moose and unless it becomes an imminent threat to people, they will not be coming out to remove it. Last week they did have to tranquilize a moose in Freeport. Apparently they're not as dopey as they look because they're smart enough to get out of the places where the hunters are going. They sure are. And smart enough to go to Peggy Kaiser's house. She makes great cookies. Yeah. And the dogs are just a nuisance. <laughs>